Yo, what's up everybody? So I've been thinking about some new videos to help you guys get better and I've gotten a whole lot of DMs and comments about how I kill people without taking a lot of damage and when I fight people I'm really really good at peeking and moving in a way where it's hard to hit me. There's a lot of things that you can do to improve on how much damage you take when you're fighting somebody so I'm going to give you some things that I do and some easy ways to prevent taking a lot of damage. But first, like always, I just want to quickly say thanks for all the new people coming to my channel. I upload daily and I drop a whole lot of tips and tricks, tutorial videos, to try to help you guys get better at fighting and whatever. So if you're one of the 71% of people that watch my videos and you aren't subscribed, I'm begging you. You should really just quickly sub because I put 100% into all my videos and I promise that you'll improve by watching me. All right, now that you've done all of that, the first thing I really want to cover to take less damage is movement. It's probably the most underrated technique of fighting to be honest. Movement is so important and can make your opponent miss the easiest shots on you. You can practice movement by aim dueling your friends or playing game modes with like natural cover and creative. Basically your goal is to strafe your opponent's shots making it harder for him to hit you and line up a headshot while you move. I cannot tell you how many times I baited somebody with my movement when I ran out of mats and then made them miss easy shots, so definitely keep movement in mind. Also I'll leave a code to where you can uh, 1v1m duel your friends in the description. Next thing I want to cover is making the right edit. There is always a right and wrong way to edit in box fights and making the wrong edit can result in taking unnecessary damage and even lose you the fight. Everything in box fights should be right hand peaks, and somehow if you get in your opponent's box and you have the stair edit on him, you can still right hand peek it by flipping the stair towards you and crouching under the stair. Your opponent will barely see you when you do this and you'll get free damage on him. This edit takes a while to get in your muscle memory and sometimes I still forget to do it, but it is one of the smartest edits in the game when you're in a box with somebody and if you hit all of your shots then you will never ever lose off of that edit. Even if your opponent is moving around in the box, you can still set it up when he stops moving. So I highly, highly recommend learning that simple edit. Also, making the right edit doesn't just mean editing instantly. Sometimes when you edit, your opponent is waiting on it and will pre-fire you or just instantly shoot you and then rebox. If you notice that your opponent is staring at you or you just don't feel like you should edit, Wait until your opponent stops looking at you or stops challenging you and then claim the boxes around him to bait an uncontested shot. The last thing I want to cover is high ground peaks. If someone is challenging you on low ground, either with a charge or a pump, you can easily get free shots without exposing your body. First off, never ever ever jump for a peak on high ground. Your body will be fully exposed and you can easily get tagged from whoever is challenging you most of the time. What you want to do in that situation is just move forward into your crosshairs just over your opponent and then instantly shoot and build right after and your opponent will only see your body for like a split second and unless they pre-fire you, you will never ever get tagged. You'll probably have to practice this some but it's really simple once you get the timing and you'll most likely never trade damage with your opponent. Well guys, that's pretty much all the advice I have in this tutorial. If you use what I taught you today, play your edits smarter and then use your movement, you will start winning fights without even getting tagged. If I helped you today or in any of my tutorials, please make sure to subscribe, follow my socials linked in the description, and use my code Slide2K9 on shop. Alright guys, until next time, peace.